Hello Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Welcome and welcome cross watchers. Let's take a look and see what is it that you need to know at the time that you're watching this reading. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, follow me on all social media, TikTok, Instagram. I am spiritually cooled on all platforms. And if you are interested in a personal reading done by myself, all of that info will be left in the description box below for you all with the link to my website spirituallycooled.com for you to view the different options for readings. Okay, what is coming in for the Aquarius is watching this right now? We have the Five of Swords, the King of Swords, the Nine of Cups, the Wheel of Fortune, Seven of Cups, and the Queen of Pentacles at the bottom. Ooh, you have some fortune coming in. Wheel of Fortune and the Queen of Pentacles. You've been really focused on business, on the things that you enjoy doing. And I'm just seeing a change, a really positive change, but meant to be faded. There's something here that is changing or the wheel is turning in your favor, Nine of Cups, and it feels like a wish fulfillment. Like you are getting multiple of your desires um, being met here. Seven of Cups. Whoa. But right now I definitely see that there's something you're, you're feeling confused about. There's some confusion about a situation or a person at this moment. Could be this King of Swords. Could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius here. Um, someone who's been giving off like a really detached version of themselves. So you're not getting a lot of emotion from this person and you're maybe feeling a little bit confused as to why they are so distant. Cause that's what it feels like. It's like someone's showing up as being, uh, very distant or serious and you're like, why is this person so serious all of a sudden? Okay. I am seeing the five of swords. So it does feel like there's some sort of conflict or this person is feeling um, upset about something. Why the five of swords? Yes. This person is like irritated over a situation. Why the five of swords? Four of swords. Okay, <laughs> it's like someone has went too long without replying or without um, any actions for of sorts. So there's been some conflict due to the fact that um, things have been slowed down or have been on pause. Like someone took a... a a rain check, I think that's the saying. <laughs> like, I I feel like you're at this point right now where you're just really embracing um, your own desires being met and getting to a place where you're actually feeling fulfilled within yourself and you're happy with where things are. And they're not so happy. They're not so happy. It's like, you're like, you know what, we don't have to be in a relationship um, because I think things are good as it is. Or, you know what, we don't need to like work on this right now. Things are okay as it is. We don't, it, it's like you're okay with the way that something is right now. You're happy about it. But someone's wanting more. Someone's wanting more of you, Aquarius. Someone's wanting more of you. And because you're so focused on your own happiness, they're not getting that, or they feel like they're not getting that. Okay. I'm also seeing there's, you're getting like options, offers. Tell me about this Seven of Cups. A lot of opportunities and offers that are putting a smile on your face. Okay. Yeah, Six of Wands, you're getting a lot of attention all of a sudden. 
It's like all of a sudden you're getting a lot of attention, someone's seeing you getting a lot of attention and they feel like they're being left out. This attention has somebody feeling uh, like you're like you've forgotten about them in some way. Okay. Hmm. I do see that it does seem that out of these offers or opportunities or just the confusion in general, something is being distorted, someone's not being honest or is like, it's like, for example, someone saying, I'm not upset when you're, when they're clearly upset, says the truth is being distorted. Proceed with caution until the fog lifts. So you're being called to um, allow something to unfold slowly, slowing down, be cautious, because when you slow down, you can see things for what they are. You can see things more clearly rather than if you're zooming past things, you can't see it clearly, right? So I do see that this will pass. This fogginess or this confusion, it says stagnation will soon pass. Use it as a vehicle for self-development. Increase your personal power at this moment. Because this Wheel of Fortune, like, this is soon. This is like, Wheel of Fortune, I always think of, like, seasons. Like, things happening by seasons. You're entering a season of just luck. Wheel of Fortune is luck. Tell me about this Wheel of Fortune. A wish fulfillment. Dreams being met goals being met luck being on your side the end of a, a the end of a stressful time the end of a conflict nine of swords are reversed if, if you're stressing right now or things are stressing you right now and you're feeling really anxious just know that this is like this is going to change there's a really positive change that is putting to rest some of your worries like the things that you may be stressing or worrying about right now are no longer going to be an issue moving forward like this is going to change your life in a way where things are going to be very different the things that you stress about now are going to be of the past okay so tell me about this king of swords what do they want what do they want with Aquarius? The world reverse, temperance reverse. Okay, so they want to get back on track with you. They feel like something hasn't wrapped up or completed itself. Or like you two both have a common goal here. Um, they want to move towards a milestone and a chapter with you where things are peaceful and balanced and in harmony. And like they just they want to get back on track with you. They're taking this time to reassess and lay a foundation, trying to develop a strategy on how to get back on track here with you. They're coming in with communication. Okay. If you have someone in mind, think of them. Let's take a look and see. How they feel about you, about this situation with you for the rest of the month. We have the Ten of Wands, Nine of Pentacles, Two of Cups, the Hermit reversed, and the, the World reversed. Yeah, so this person feels like there's some unfinished business here. Like... They, they do see... They do feel like this... Like something has made things really hard for the both of you. Um... Like their work has been very demanding. Nine of Pentacles, Ten of Wands. Something about this person's work is very demanding. And they are trying to complete that cycle of like a time of maybe a lot of work, a lot of responsibility on their shoulders that they're focusing on right now to get to a better place independently. Uh, but they want to connect with you they feel like you're somebody who understands them they want to get back on track so it feels like you two have kind of gotten off track or started to do things kind of separately 
and they want to come back together instead of instead of doing things separately or going in different directions. So they see you as a hermit. You may have been silent or you are you they may feel like you've had doubts. You've had your doubts here. Okay, Knight of Swords reversed. The Empress. Yeah, they see that you're in like no rush right now. Like you're not rushing past anything. You're slowing things down. You're taking things day by day. Um, Empress energy. You're somebody who they see as like their... Like they really do see you as their dream partner. Two of Cups is like union and partnership. They see you as their dream partner. And they don't want to go in separate directions or like they don't want to do things separately. They want to come back together after a time of maybe um, both of you being really busy or doing things separately and, and being kind of quiet or not communicating as much. So they're, they're trying to reconnect or bring back a connection here and express what's on their heart. Tell you how they feel and show you how they feel through their actions. Their actions are going to show you. Yeah, it's like somebody was uh, irritated and now they're opening up about the fact about why they were feeling irritated. There's going to be some sort of change here. Stagnation is passing in a situation or with a person. Is there anything else that Aquarius needs to know right now? Page of Pentacles. There is a message coming through. A really, I'm seeing good news. Good news. That you're not seeing it right now. The moon is like... Lack of clarity again, fog, fog like this. There's something here that you're just not seeing at this moment, you're or you're not seeing the growth of 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 this of this um, new beginning. But the answers, the answers will come. You're gonna get the answers. You're gonna get the clarity, and it's gonna be very soon. And it's gonna be. I'm seeing all good. All good. I'm hearing confirmed, validated. I'm seeing the numbers 5, 9, 10. Those numbers could be synchronicity, special days. Also the number 7 is here. The letters F, Z, R, M, S, O, U, E. Those letters could be in your name or someone else's. But with that said, this is what I'm seeing. If it did resonate, let me know. And if you made it this far in the video, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you. And I hope you have an amazing rest of your day, Aquarius. Bye.